What's up? What's up, guys? I cannot even tell you how excited I am today, man. It feels like freaking Christmas, you hear? It feels like Christmas, man. I've ordered a bunch of stuff online, and it just came in like 10 minutes ago. Could not even come in a better day. Today's my day off, and within another week, we'll be going to Galveston. My brother's coming in from Ohio, and we're going to tow the boat down there. We're going to do some fishing. All right, enough said. Let me show you what I got, man. That way you understand why I'm so excited about this. All right, so I got me this. This is the rope bag. We've been throwing our ankle rope all over the place. Step on it, trip on it. Man, for safety purposes, I found this online. It's really nice. All right, what really nice about this bag is on the inside here, Check this out. It had this styrofoam cushion on the back. All right, what this does is when you coil your anchor line in here, right? If you need to throw this overboard really fast because you were chasing that fish, whatever fish you're chasing, you can come back later and retrieve it because this will float, okay? And what you see in here, this it's called an anchor retriever pulley. All right, what you do is you feed your rope through here. This is the anchor side. I'll come through this way. This is the boat side. Instead of pulling the anchor rope by hand, you can now tow the anchor rope with your boat. Of course, not in the high speed, trolling speed only. What that does is it's pulling your rope, it's pulling your anchor through here, and this little mechanism will come down and it will stop the rope from sliding backward and then stop your anchor and your chain from sinking to the seabed or lake bed where you're fishing. And this little device up here is where your anchor retriever buoy goes. It holds up your rope, your chain, and your anchor from dropping back down to the seabed. Super stoked, man. Super stoked. I don't have to pull it with my hand anymore. Also, I've been wanting some lighting on the front of the boat as well as on the back of the boat. And let me show you something. Ta-da! The light bar. This will go on the front of the boat. This will go on the back of the boat. We're gonna have more than lighting we need now. Hopefully, if we do some night fishing, if weather permitted, this will light up the water and will attract some bait fish. And when you need to come into the dock, it will light up the whole dock. Why I added, I went ahead and ordered me two wiring harness kit for both the front and the back lights. And what really nice about this is it had a toggle switch on and off. I don't have to mess with it, you know? And we've been laying our tackle box, our tools, our wallet, everything around. This right here, my friend, will make it really, really clean. All right. You can hang this on your T-top, on the side, using these bungee cords, okay? You can store your tackle box in here, your wallet, your cell phone, food, drinks, whatever in here. It's gonna make it really clean, man. I cannot tell you how good this will be. Oh, and by the way, I might be able to do another video to show you guys how I install those lights. So look out for another video coming at you. I see you next week when I'm out on the water.